Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, today I was wanting to go through with you guys some stuff that we have picked up for Little Miss Mila Janae within the past couple weeks and one of them was actually a gift and they're for um, her motor skills and just development and um, I she, I didn't really have anything for her to play with. She didn't have a whole lot of toys. She had some stuff, but I figured now that she is getting older and starting to be more aware of her surroundings and what's going on around her and wanting to play more, that we would pick up some stuff for her just to help her move along um, with her developmental stages now that she is four and a half months. A couple things that we had got, um, it's all for her, um, but some of the stuff are like for me too. Like, um, I got, I got this, it's not in here anymore, but I got this right here. It's a nursing cover and I really wish that I would have gotten one for myself like a long time ago. Some of you ladies are okay with just whipping out your boob and <laughs> feeding the baby. But as for me, um, I've never been like a really conservative, modest person, but when it comes to her, um, I do tend to be a little bit more modest, and so I like to, I don't mind breastfeeding anywhere, but it makes me feel so much more comfortable just having um, my boob a little bit more covered, because there is still creeps out there, so. All right, anyways, so I got also this Infantino carrier, and it is a really nice carrier. Um, I like the fact that it has a really nice material. It's um, more of a, gosh, what kind of material is it? It's not like fabric. It's more of like a, uh, what's the word? It's a breathable material that is just really great, um, especially being that I live here in Arizona and it, it gets hot. So I needed something that was going to be nice and breathable and easy to clean. So I've got that. Um, we got this for her. It's by Sassy Tummy Time Playmat. And it's really cute. It has a mirror so she's able to look at herself. And um, she, she doesn't really like um, to do tummy time. So we figured that we would get something a little bit more exciting for her to um, do her tummy time. All right, and then this is Mila's tummy time toy. You can see she could see herself through the mirror. Hello, pretty girl. And she got little toys on the end of the pillow, and the pillow just kind of helps her keep her elevated. But the only thing I have a problem with this um, pillow is that it slides out from underneath her like really quick. She's only been in here for a few seconds, and the pillow's already gotten out from underneath her, so just kind of move that. So yeah, this is her tummy time toy. And we got this, the Exer Saucer, and I just think it's so cute. Um, we've tried it already once here um, in our house and in our bathroom because, like, um, you have to have a little bit of a ledge to put it up right, right here in this picture. And so our bathroom in our room was the only place that had enough um, space to put this clip on. And um, so I had to say, like, if you have normal sized doors, when they're really small um, and their coordination isn't really that great, she was kind of like going around in circles and a little bit like went over and bopped her head. It was very lightly, but it made her enough to not be happy. So <laughs> she wasn't too happy about it. So then I took it over to my mom's house um, because she has like a really big um, doorway in her room and stuck her in there again and uh, she's just not too crazy about the the jumper quite yet because she doesn't quite get it um, but I know within the next couple weeks we'll, we'll try it again um, just you know gradually showing her it and introducing it to her again and I know she'll really enjoy it because it's it just looks like a lot of fun okay and then this is already out we already took it out but it's this right here it's the Explore and Store Activity Gym. And so um, Mila actually really likes this a lot. Just lay her on it and she just goes to town playing with this and she loves it. So um, here's a better, bigger picture in the back. 
and that's what it looks like. So she she really likes that a lot. Um, I definitely recommend that because she super enjoys it. She just like grabs up and grabs the toys and her coordination is getting so good. Before it was just kind of like her flailing her arms and hitting them, but now she actually is, goes and grabs them and, and plays with them, the toys. So that's really, really great. Little Miss Mila absolutely loves this toy. See, look at how good her hand coordination is getting. Alright. Good girl, Mila. Go, Mila. Go, Mila. Go, Mila. Go, go. Hey, mommy. So, just really working on her developmental skills and her coordination. So, she likes it a lot. Good girl, mommy. We also got this as a gift last week from my husband's work, his, um, his, the group he works with, they got us this and I am so excited. Um, this right here, these two white trays, they move out so this way this becomes like a little food tray for snacks and so she's really liking that and the Minnie Mouse right here, the little circle Minnie Mouse, it's like, um, reminds me of those like globes. It turns around and plays music, and it's just really cute. I really like it a lot. So, and it's adjustable. It goes higher or lower depending on the height of a child. What do you think? There's so many things on here. Look. <laughs> What do you think, Miss Mila? Feet. Yeah, feet. Now this, this is something that I am super excited about. Um, I had saw this on Vasir Beauty's channel. Her name's Brittany and her channel is Vasir Beauty. And she got this for her child. And so I went right away and looked it up and was like, oh my gosh, this is like such a cool invention. This right here is the Nogal, and I'm just covering up my address, but um, this is amazing. Let me show you a picture of it here on the side. So what you do is um, you plug it in to your air vent, and then it goes to the back seat to the child, so as so. So there's different ways right here that it shows that you could hook it up and your baby can get air in the back. Or if you live in a cold state, they can get heating in the back. Because, you know, our little ones depend on us for comfort. And whether if it's really hot or cold, um, we need to make sure that they're as comfortable as possible because, I mean, we're up in the front with the vents right on us and on our faces. So, I mean, in not, either we're nice and cool or nice and warm, um, depending on the temperature of where you're at. And so it is extremely important to not forget about your baby in the back seat that's either hot or cold. And, you know, like I said, they depend on us for comfort. So this is just really, really awesome invention. I just absolutely love it. So you can put it back here like this or um we actually put ours like we put it all the way to the back seat and then the headrest of her headrest where she'd be at we just like went under and around it and just stuck it in the headrest and so um we didn't want to point it in her face so we pointed it to her body like on her feet so this way she can get the air and it's just so easy and straightforward um you just clip it into your vent and just stick this um little nozzle on it and it's so easy to put on and take off and I mean I'm just absolutely raving about this um, because I used to get so concerned being that it's starting to get hot already um, 
here in Arizona and I would just be feeling so bad for my baby girl and I'd be like fanning her throughout every trip that we would go on and now that I have that I can you know be more at ease to get into the car because I know that she's going to be comfortable too. So um, those are some things that we got and I'm really excited about the stuff that we got here um, recently and we got them all for really good deals. Um, we either went on Amazon or to Burlington and um, the walker was a gift. So just really great deals that we've gotten. This we got was, in, it was an eight footer. There's six foot, eight foot and 10 feet. And I was like not too sure what to get. So we got the eight foot. The six foot is for like a small car. We have a small SUV. So we got the eight foot and it was, I mean, just perfect size. And then the 10 foot would be if you have a van or a larger SUV. So just really great things that I was just wanting to share with you guys because I was really excited about them and um, was just wanting to share. So if you guys have like any favorites that your baby absolutely loves and want to share with me as to what it is, I would absolutely love to know. And all these items that I am showing you guys, I will put them down in the description below um, so you guys could check them out and um, order them for your baby if you want that, you know just to give you guys an idea. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down at the bottom and give it a thumbs up and I will be seeing you soon. Have a blessed day. Mm -hmm. Bye.